We're just moments away from this huge tag team match, guys. And I don't think I've ever seen these four superstars more motivated than they appear to be heading into this one, Michael. Product of the Hart Family Dungeon carrying on the legacy of the legendary Hart Family in sports entertainment. Natalia always ready to handle things inside the ring. Yeah, the daughter of Jim the Animal Knight Hart, the niece of WWE Hall of Famer Brett the Hitman Hart. She's got the power of her father and the finesse of her uncle. Maybe the most respected superstar in the entire women's division. Women's division, I hope you're ready for a fight. Tamina is a scary woman. That is a scary human being. Ah, oh, yeah, it's go time. And here we go, tag Ouch. team action underway. And who's starting this one off for her team? The Queen of Hearts, Natalia. Guys, there's nothing like a good old-fashioned tag team match. Go oh, right to the kidneys. Golly. Too concerned, however. She's putting up quite a fight here, Cole, but despite that, now is probably a good time to look for the tag. At this point, I think it's fair to call into question her preparation for this match. She's clearly being outclassed right now. This might be it! Oh, my! Tag made. Well, I don't think this is going to be good at all. Oh, this has got to be dangerous. Targeting the back. Very effective. Man, what a slam! Boom, what impact! Boom! He 
Before joining the sports entertainment ranks, Dana Brooke was a world-class gymnast, fitness competitor, and professional bodybuilder. But when Dana Brooke came to NXT, she came for one reason and one reason only, to dominate. Kidneys. Golly. Perhaps a power bomb here, Corey. That certainly seems to be the case. Boom! <laughs> Challenger is starting to falter. She's going to need to oh, find man. a way to mount an offense here. Nice Russian leg sweep. Nailed it. Oh, nasty impact. Tags made. This is classic tag team wrestling. Double team in effect. Oh, damage to the body. The challenger's taking on some offense. Heard her partner making it a great tag team. We'll see what they're made of here. The good news is that if it gets too out of control, she has her partner she can tag in while she catches her breath in the corner. It's been quite the back and forth battle for these women, guys, and I'm willing to bet that's the way it's gonna be the rest of the way. Avoids trouble there. In off the tag. Vicious strike. She dodges that one. Wow, what a leg sweep. And then, oh, crushing the knee here. In comes Tamina. Irish whip. Taking off her feet now. And you're not going to win many matches down there. I can tell you that. Oh, man, what a boot. What a stomp. Good grief. Got uh -oh. the all Beautiful technique. The challenger's starting to slow down a bit here. We've certainly seen her withstand worse in the past, though. I really like the resolve we've seen from her in this tag team match, guys. Though, I wouldn't be against the tag here. You know, just so she can gather herself a bit. These women are so evenly matched at this point, guys. There's just no telling which one of them will walk out of here victorious. When you talk about great tag teams, we can go all the way back to teams like the Tolos brothers, Stevens and Patterson, Stevens and Bockwinkle, the Texas Outlaws, the Briscoes, the Blackjacks, the Andersons, and the list goes on and on. When you're part of a tag team, the two partners have to travel together, train together, eat together, and be completely in sync with one another. Big backdrop, a bad place to be for the challenger. The challenger's championship aspirations are beginning to fade. Tag team competition dates back all the way to the early 1900s. Corey, you mentioned some of the classic duos from sports entertainment's incredible history. In today's WWE, the tag team scene has never been more competitive. I don't know who has the edge when it comes to talent, if it's Raw or SmackDown Live. I think it's too close to call, but all the teams truly think and act as one unit. I agree, Michael. Teams such as the Usos, American Alpha, Anderson and Gallows, the New Day, the Hardy Boys, Cesaro and Sheamus. I could be here all day naming. She's turning the tables. They ain't turned yet. Still got some work to do. For many years, members of the WWE Universe. Wow, this is far away, all the way back here. Natalia is rolling now. Natalia going for the submission. She better do something fast. Byron, earlier you raised a point that people have been talking about for years, and that's a second referee being appointed to tag team matches. I remember WWE Hall of Famer and former WWE President Gorilla Monsoon used to express his strong advocacy for two referees being appointed to tag team matches. Uh, it's something that's been talked about for decades, Michael, and I don't think it's ever going to happen. We've seen it on occasion, but I think it's best to let the superstars be responsible for themselves. Double underhook applied. Up and Natalia says, not this time. Over the last few years, the tag team scene in WWE is hotter than it's ever been. 
One of the teams that has shined brighter than any other is the New Day. Xavier Woods, Big E, and Kofi Kingston are two-time tag team champions. But it was their... Queen of Hearts looking to finish things off. He's about to do so, Corey. If she can step... Sharpshooter applied. Man, looked like the champ was down and out for a moment there, but not anymore. Natalia is rolling now. They got it. And here's another quick look at those superstars in action in that tag team battle. I remember this part very well. She's taking care of business. Almost forgot about this one. And last but not least. And that's a nice win for these two here tonight. What we just saw there was a doctorate class in tag team competition. They just took the game to a whole other level. And I'll tell you, the roof nearly blew off this place in Rosemont when the bell finally rang to end this one.